<gasps> Simulator Sunday number one. We are playing Gasp. Hey, what is up, guys? Trucks here, and I'm starting to get back into the swing of videos with our very first episode of Simulator Sunday, showcasing Gasp, a game that has overwhelmingly po negative reviews on Steam. Let's check out the credits real quick, and people actually put their names on this. Okay then, Catabelle at least, that's like some sort of username and she's not tied to this project so she can get a job in the future. But anyways, let's start the game and see what this has to offer. Oh gosh, there's DLC for this game and you thought EA was bad. Warning, this game is not designed to hold your hand. Once you die, then you die Hello? and are free from this curse. Uh, I'm not Hello? okay, my We're mouse wrong. is not fixed to the screen. I um I honestly think this uh this voice recording is a child. I'm not even joking. I think this is an actual child speaking. It it sounds like an 11 year old girl. All right. Well, apparently I'm hurt. What are we trying to do? If I look down, I'm on Venus. Did I just got what the heck? How did I get? And hit by an asteroid! Oh my gosh! Where is that coming from? What the heck? It, it's an asteroid rain or something. I don't know. Oh gosh. It's an asteroid rain and I just lose all light whenever I look down. What sort of sickness is this? Oh, 360 into darkness. What is this freaking helmet wobble? Nobody walks like this. Seriously, just side to side. You know, some people might lean that far, but walking, man, it's like a bobblehead. Hmm. Bask at the billion dollar International Space Station in all its pixelated glory. Oh, jeez. Holy crap. What is going on? Why are there asteroids raining down? Why are they bouncing off? Okay, there's an unknown signal like a kilometer that way. I'm gonna try and make it, even though I'm on 55% oxygen. And I can do it, yes I can, because I'm a Jewish American. I need to get that song out of my head. Little known fact, satellites are actually the size of the continent of Africa. I will give this game one thing, it runs at a fairly consistent 60 unlike most AAA games these days. Oh my gosh, Indiana Jones that, whoo, wow, remember kids, Asteroids don't create craters. They'll just come right after you. And that's why we need Donald Trump as a president. We're still talking about asteroids, right? Apparently, moon gravity only works when you hold space. If you release it, it's back to Earth. Alright, less than half a kilometer to our target. Please, just end it. I can't even walk. It's, you know... Boulders aren't a threat when they just kind of disappear. 300 meters away, we're almost there. If my freaking bobblehead guy can walk straight, we'll make it okay. Is that headed towards me? I can't tell. Dr. Man, do not engage the airlock. I repeat, do not engage the airlock. Engaging the airlock could cause random meteor showers on the moon. Dr. Man, do not engage the airlock. Okay, I found a pod. Maybe Matt... Okay. Um, well, it appears that in the future, humans... Mastered the art of levitation and... In ending... What? Okay. Glad you're awake, sir. How is cryogenics? What the heck? Seems while you were under, we had an incident. My radar is telling me the life count on the station went from 100 to 1. We need to investigate. If... Glad you're awake. Okay. Coming 2016. So you've got that to look forward to. Alrighty then. That was gas, I suppose. Simulator Sunday, it's gonna be fun, well have fun, Simulator Sunday, oh 
Jeez, that was something. Well, anyways, Simulator Sunday. Tune back next Sunday for another episode where we'll play something other than this game. In the meantime, be sure to follow me on Twitter and support me on Patreon and check out my other series. I will see you all next week, and goodbye!